when she talked, walked up to me, she said, I'll answer your questions, but you have to wait. And uh, there was a line forming up there. So I went over and uh, uh, I sat down and looked over my questions, only two of them, kind of long ones, uh, and uh, was trying to figure out which one and, and whether I, I should, uh, you know, ask those questions. Uh, when I, I heard uh, the sound of gunshots and I looked over only about 10 or 15 feet away where Gabrielle Giffords had been standing, and in her place was a uh, very uh, excited gunman who was athletically pumping out uh, the rounds and, and pointing the gun at, at anybody that he could get a bead on. Uh, people around me were being hit. I just dove for the ground, and while I was diving for the ground, a round hit me in the knee. Uh, I was conscious of that, and while I was on the ground, I guess another one, another round hit me in the back. A, a fragment did hit me in the back. Uh, a woman went over and, and uh, knocked a clip out of his hand. He was reloading. He had a, a Glock 9mm with uh, a 30-round clip in it. And my thought on the ground was that he's going to come and, and finish us off. But this woman knocked the other clip out of his hand. Then a couple of guys came along, bystanders, and they uh, tackled him, knocked him to the ground. I was uh, in shock, and I, I just wandered out into the parking lot. And a woman was pushing a, a cart full of groceries out there, and I said to her, I've been shot. And she just looked at me like I was crazy. I was taken to the hospital, and uh, even though I was sedated and everything, I, I uh, stayed up. I was staying up, uh, stayed up most of the night, and uh, I didn't know how to calm myself down. So I, I wrote down the Declaration of Independence, uh, which I memorized some time ago, and that did help to organize my thoughts. And the first thing that I wrote down and, and what my reaction was to it was how many other people, how many other demented people are out there. It looks like Palin, Beck, Sharon Engel, and the rest got their first target. Their wish for Second Amendment activism has been fulfilled. Senseless hatred leading to murder, lunatic fringe anarchism, subscribed to by John Boehner, mainstream rebels, with vengeance for all, even nine-year-old girls. There was a little girl named Christina Green, nine years old, who was one of the deceased. Uh, another thing I wrote down was, can we have another fundraiser out at the target range, Jesse Kelly? Jesse Kelly ran against her in, uh, in the election, and I've heard him speak several, a couple of times, and... Uh, uh, I, I couldn't believe he was a real candidate. I, I thought he was he was just a, 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 like a, a fake candidate. It doesn't seem like anybody would consider him seriously. He came within 4,000 votes of winning the election. His uh, One of his slogans was, shoot a fully automatic M16 with Jesse Kelly. Kind of a, a, kind of a, a, a very uh, 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 marginal personality and a low mentality. I worked hard to elect Gabrielle Giffords. I would rather she was, a, she was busy doing her job today than lying in a hospital with a gunshot wound in the head.